Welcome back everybody, let's play Ori in the Blind Forest. Oh dear, this is a big windy place that I don't remember everything about. Anyway, because we're in a new place actually. So then, I still don't know how to get to this thing, I wish to find out one day, and I think I will. Same goes for this thing down here. But, for now, we need to go left, and I guess up too, to get that key up there. It's right over here though. So hopefully, having played this for a week won't make me suck at actually trying to navigate this place. Seems to be going well enough so far. I don't like these low points going up and down. Every time you take out your uh, feather, it makes your broken momentum completely reset. It's kind of awkward. Looks so much like there must be stuff right here. Ha ha! I actually had to go right here too. Hand game, that is. Very high expectation for you to have me. They stuck a mandatory key in a very non obvious hole. I love that triple jump so much. Okay. Ow. Alright. Yay! And open up for me. You have kind things to say to me, green thing? Of course you do. I have kind things to say about you too. Alright. You're saying them more effectively. Okay. So now that little crisis is over. We have once again established a place of safety. I guess all there is to do is. Ooh, go down to this little safe point actually. Let's go! Oh, I've got that! Why didn't I realize that would be there? Ow. Thankfully, I can heal this thing. Alright, no, I can't. I get stuff from this thing. Darn it, I thought that was a fountain for some reason. And this is cool too. This sounds practical. Actually, I'll just wait until I get this to save. Did I hear a little bit of the main theme just now? No, I don't think so. I still love return motifs. I don't think that's the right word. Throughout a game, though. I'm hearing the same melody throughout. No more Heroes 2 did really kind of well. Hmm. It looks like that gives us a certain other advantage, too. Only one way to find out. Well. That works. So I'm curious, then. High places might that let me into? They'll let me into here. So that's one thing. Not sure about that experience, still. I should up have a couple of things, at least. I wasn't aware of how to get through. There's still some walls, I think. I couldn't figure out how to break. Like, there's at least one wall I think that was a vertical wall. I couldn't figure out how to break their own thing open. I'll have to find it later, though. But for now. No, I'm only gonna get through here. These are spiky, aren't they? Oh, never mind. So can I like run around and charge it? I can. Alright, so I can charge pretty much whatever. That's cool. Man, yeah, that's rough. Wait a minute. Yeah, how do I get up here? That's confusing me a little bit. And the wonders of watching somebody learn for the first time. Alright. Oh. Does it charge longer than I thought it did or something? I felt like it was fully charged just then, but... Charge all jump. Yeah, I was wondering about if I could do that. I'll hold left or right. That's how I can break through these things now. Okay, so I can break through all these walls now, I think. 
still kind of wish that there would be more indication I could have done that before. That was actually lagging something to break through these walls. It's kind of frustrating. Oh, that would have been cool if I actually did it well. I like this a lot. Hello! bit more experience along the way too. I can make even more use of enemies with it at the same time. If I can hit this one spider right now. I can get rid of this guy before he makes me go back to a checkpoint. Hey, lots of experience. And also, vaguely looked like that was not a ceiling, mostly because it wasn't. That worked out. That's an ability cell. One step closer to getting yet another one of our cherished extra abilities. What did we want to get next anyways? I think I wanted to get either defense or sense. I think I wanted to get sense because we have to do more stuff later. None of these seem too useful for me. I don't think I'm usually gonna have to do. Maybe I will have to do with forward targets later on. But for now, the other stuff seems real practical. Not dying seems kind of cool. As does making life easier in terms of searching everywhere. Maybe I go higher if I hold the A. Oh, come on, see that there. Maybe I go higher if I hold the A button. Like the X button. So I, I hold I do that. If I tap it. Yeah, I see. That was the problem I was doing the first time. I wasn't holding jump on long enough. Alright. Now everything is charged. Funk. I like it, though. More modes of transportation. In a way that I can really live with. Okay, nope, that's not gonna work. It's better. This reminds me a little bit of the uh, flying ability and... Oh, come on. Ow. Walk a melee. I was wondering if this game would have something like that. It's like something that just like covers a wall in spikes. Yeah, I destroyed the spikes. Oh, other things also destroyed that too, though. A oh, crap. Aha! There we go. And this is not a very nice looking spirit well. But it is a spirit well, and spirit wells are inherently nice, I say. It's how nice. Let me just save if I just heal and everything. So, we're about where we need to be. Once we head on back, I'm hoping only get to I'm hoping only get to pass through Sorrow Pass after this, so I can go pick up that life cell. But we have uh, lots of new things to gather now. Because you use you use that ability at lots of new places, I'm sure. Like I can get through that thing now, I'm sure. So I should be able to get plenty of ability cells too with this new ability. Come on, Roy. Move slowly, please. I still think Rory's acceleration is a little bit high. Mm. Precision! Boom! I love how to play speed there. So, just how high up I angle my jumps. Very. Would be the answer to that. Alright. Wrong! And every time I play this game, I spend what feels like a couple of minutes playing the game. I look at the timer, and it's been like 15 minutes already. Oh, cool, we have lasers here. Uh, I might as well connect this back to the past, though. Toward the past. Something to the past. Hot top it. It's like it for rushing. Now, if we could please be civil and 
I thought I can throw lasers. Lasers. Oh. Hi. That's how lasers to deal with, but... I can ride the draft up here now, too. Actually, I think I had to open this up to go up higher. Well, no, maybe not. I might be able to climb the wall otherwise. I'll be able to float up now. There we go. Oh no, I have one path to float up. Well, a little more grand then. This place really isn't so bad. Nothing over there? Nothing over there. Pays to pay attention to this game, apparently. I saw that just earlier this episode. Finally, something a little bit more clear. And there is a volcano. Beauty makes chaos. I do, of course, wonder what might be over to the right there. Not anything of interest, it looks like. And anything that could possibly be interesting to me will appear on my map now, so... Nothing should be hidden over there. This is looking a little warm. What say you, Zane? Well, would we want it to not do that? I wouldn't think so. Well, got yeah, the sunstone. And more places to go along with it. Can I just kind of sit up here for a while and enjoy the view? I knew the tree down below is nice, but. Doesn't like I can get this in many places in the forest. Good to see you again. I suppose that wouldn't be a good thing to have happen. This location feels very... Ah, that's where that goes. I was wondering. 
I'm getting a sense of finality with this hollow with this uh place. And Mount Haru. I mean I'm guessing the game will tell me, hey, this is like the end of the road. If I go up to a place that's actually the end. Goodbye, sweet son. But still. Just want to be wary. I don't know if I'll start my journey for 100% just yet or not. But since I'm here, I do want to pick all this stuff up here. There's some experience down there too, so I might as well go with that. Like I said before, I know experience isn't necessary for 100%, but... I still want to have it. I'll speed up me getting the abilities I want anyways. Probably should have seen this the first time I went by it, but oh well. Now then. I just want... I want to figure out how to get that one, uh... other bit of experience, too. I was wondering if there were lasers down here. But now there's primarily that, uh... Look, I save here. That life cell. That I want to go get. I have a feeling that I might be needing it. Hello! How are you? Come on. How many all this just barely too late with that projectile? Well, that was way too early. So then... It was in a place that I don't know I, if I should go to from here or there. I want to go to the left. Uh -huh. I'll go down and left. I have a feeling that'll be quicker because you have to go around the little lasers and whatnot if you go backwards. So let's take the original route. All I had to do was enter from down here. Please. Come on. Yeah, down here. My other things are trying to hurt me. And it seems projectiles right through me, it looks like. Okay. So I want to go left over there. Or up, more specifically. Yeah, I can just jump right here. I'm kind of curious. Could I have... I just apparently can't make that. Right, I want to see if I, if I could have climbed up there. And then... <laughs> yeah. Hello. Boom. Goodbye. I love messing with those birds so much. And I felt like I earned this. I was wondering if that switch was in here. This is the switch that other uh, little ability bit. There we go. So let's run down there and grab that real quick, and then we can be on our merry way. Probably won't get much done this episode, aside from getting this and getting out of here, though. And along with everything we already did this episode, at least. But I'm not gonna say farewell to just yet or anything. I'll be very preemptive. But I like to share my plans. I have so much health now. And it's gone to the point where. I kind of have so much health, I forget to ever even look at how much I have. I just kind of realize sometimes that I'm on the verge of death, and other times I'm just completely fine. I usually make enough checkpoints and just kind of cross enough good stuff to not suffer the consequences of, mess of playing too badly. I don't know if it's the game being easier or just me reaping the benefits of collecting a bunch of health. 
I think it's the former. I know how to get up here too now. Oops. I could have gone up here earlier. Oops. Through other means. As I demonstrated. But. Ah. Now I can do that as intended. And benefit from that as well. Um, okay. So I don't think there's anything else to do up here. Oh, Star Pass is still only 99. I guess I might want you to pick up that. Oh, I might want me to uh, go up there so it'll fill in the map. Because I'm very, very sure that I've gone to other places in the game and gone 100% without actually picking up all the experience bits. It doesn't look like you can really go right and up, so I'll just go up right now. Well, can I? Oh, no, I can't go straight up, in fact. So I'll just have to go this way. Alright. It's kind of hard to see these guys' projectiles, all the graphical effects everywhere. Go away. I forgot there was a gust here. Anyways. Dupt and lasers! Garg, there are lasers here, too. It's never a good thing to forget. Those are the last of lasers, I think. It better be. Last of the lasers. I threat thing that I disposed of way more than I expected to. Wow. I remember when it took me forever to get rid of those things. Okay, so I wanted to go down. Yeah, so it's at the bottom of this whole thing. Are you guys really worth my time? I have a feeling you aren't. Not too much help. Tend to do too much damage to me. Hello! I always have time for you guys, though. Hello! A lot of this game doesn't have contact damage, because that would have been annoying if I just dropped right on and got hurt. I've been waiting to get this thing for quite a while now. I've been waiting longer for some other things too, but still. Off to the side here. No, thank you. Now I have the means to go up here too. Yeah, I have a feeling that I can do anything now. In fact, I feel I might as well look on the pause screen. It looks like I've basically done everything. I have all the skills. I have what looks like nearly all the world events. I have a feeling I'm going to want to clean everything up before I head on over to uh, Mount Horu. I have everything done in Sora Pass too. Now that I've done all that. Pretty sure it's because I completed the map. Uh, might as well go down to Valley of the Wind and fill in that little area there since we're here. And you have lots of places we can go to to get more stuff. Does this have like a completion meter? 86% complete apparently, alright. So, not sure how that, sh how that equates into uh, how much story I have left and how much collections everything we have left. No. Oh. Three into each other. Not right there, apparently. This is crazy. It's just a mid air combat. I'm not even uh, using my feather or anything. Oh crap. Well, I'm gonna use my feather. <laughs> it's so fun to me that. It's not fun for me. How this game just has so many different means of movement, and every way of moving actually offers its own distinct advantages, too. This game really does a lot with its platforming, and I love that. So now, uh, 
Alright, so this will be the last thing we do this episode because I'm basically out of time anyways. But I did say I want to come up here. I did say I want to go into this little portion right here. Get what's sitting in here. Since I was so frustrated right by- whoa, by it before. Go away. Uh, wherever that might be. It's uh, over to the right. Hello! Not so friendly spider friend. Uh, spider friend that I kind of needed to get around, in fact. Wait for a triple jump, okay. Now, over here. And then we'll be done for the episode. Hello, bird! Oh. Ow. Jerk. Yeah, that was really confusing. I placed things right here that make it look like I can go through here with my oops, available resources, but that's not the case at all. Boom! Instead, I can do that! Oh dear, I have a feeling we're going to be getting some uh, new stuff next episode. So I think next episode will be the cleanup episode. Because I mean, you look at this and tell me that this <laughs> big place in the center is not the final area. And we have a lot of things done, too. In fact, I've just had everything done, so I, I'm going to be kicking up some experience if I can, I guess. But just about everything else, I don't have a lot to do. It's mostly just a matter of getting there, I think. No, wait a minute. Yes, I have a lot of uh, stuff to do in terms of getting there. I'll do what I can. I might skip over the experience, but I'll get the ability points. At least. And that aside, I have some stuff to do. All throughout, my god. Uh, yeah, next episode's gonna be some uh, cleaning stuff up stuff instead of just making a beeline for Mount Horu. Yes, that's something I need to get done. So I'll see you guys next time, next episode of Let's Play Ori in the Blind Forest, where we get things done. Bye, guys! Well, 100% things done at least. <laughs>